You're watching the AM show on Joy News on your multi TV channel. Thank you so much for staying. Right now, I've got some really beautiful women here Winifred and Rita. It's good to have you here. Thank you very much. Okay, so I can see you're, you're representing your school, Slopsa, isn't Hi. it? <laughs> What's the response? Hi. Oh, really? Yes. Slopsa? Hi. Hi. Oh, really? <laughs> Interesting. So, um, you're organizing a fundraiser dinner. Why? Mm. Why is that? Um, thank you again and good morning. We have uh, a situation in the school now. The school was built as a private school for just about 400 students. And now with the education expansion, the population has grown out to 2,400. And we don't seem to have enough facilities. So we want to use this program to accumulate some funds and build a dormitory. So it's an alumni dormitory that we are trying to build. And, and so is this a fundraising generally targeted at um, alumni? Yes. So, so if... Uh, no, 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 not alumni, what you mean, we are inviting the whole world to come and help us. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so Rita, you want to add something? Yes, um, we just want to involve and also um, contribute to whatever we have also um, got from the school. Yes, so everybody, all hands on deck. Okay, yeah. so let, let me just ask you, what's, what's the part about school you miss so much? Because I'm, I'm thinking ah. that you have memories about school, don't you? I would say I'm quite ancient. I finished O-levels in 75. That's a long time. That's a long time. And that was when we had just about 300 students on campus. Everybody knew everybody. And, you know, I went through to SUS form. So it was a big family, a very big family. I have six years ahead of me. I know everybody. I know their siblings, and I have six years behind me. So you can see at that time when you go to school, you have about 13 years of building a family. And that's, um, I think, looking at what we had. It's like just being at home. Okay. School was part so of home. So is, is this being headed by a particular year group because usually in, in uh, some of these programs we see that a particular year group is wanting it but they invite others to come and join them. Mm -hmm. No, this is a slopsa all over, okay. both home and abroad. We are all coming together to support the school with this project. Mm. Yeah. And, and how much are you hoping to raise? Yeah. $700,000. Dollars? No, for the dinner dance. For the, yes. We have a target for the dinner dance. The project itself is the 700, and the dinner dance we are targeting to get about 200,000 uh, Ghana CDs. Ghana CDs, but yes. the whole project is going to cost about 700,000 700, Ghana dollars. CDs. Dollars. No, dollars. Okay, so what are the other ways of raising funds? Because if mm -hmm. just 200,000 Ghana CDs out of 700,000 yeah. dollars, that's a big yeah. difference. Actually, this particular program is being um, uh, hosted by the Accra chapter. We have various chapters all over like she said mm. so all the other chapters are also doing their various dinner dances right. and bringing in funds and then we the students the past students have have been levied to pay two thousand each anybody who came to st louis spent at least one year versus form yes you are supposed to contribute two thousand over a period of two years and we hope that um, by accumulating those funds, we can get there. But, but why should I contribute? If I'm, if I'm not an old student of St. Louis, and I'm not an old mm. student of St. Louis, but if I am sitting back at home watching you, what can you tell me to convince me to support this course? This is uh, more or less a corporate social responsibility. You see, so um, in order to get, you, you know, we are now hammering on girl-child education in order to get more girls to be educated, in order to make um, more girls comfortable in St. Louis school, we, we will urge everybody to help us. So yeah. um, currently, I know that in St. Louis, you run both uh, the boarding system and the day system. So you have people who go home and come. OK. St. Louis, we, we were doing that. Okay. But now, you'll be amazed to learn that all 2,400 students are boarders. We don't have 
a single day student unless that person opts to due to maybe health situations or because we were when the numbers started um, getting out of hand we we're getting all kinds of issues with um, the day students somewhere in hostels and uh, you know now you couldn't have control yeah control so now each and every St. Louis student is a border so that's why the need for this project we are building a 600 bed dorm and we hope it will go a long way to solve part of the problem mm, to support yeah. so to support yes so you're you're doing that to complement what's to already exactly. there or to the facilities there. okay exactly okay all right so um you didn't tell me what you miss about school she did but you didn't tell me um, what you miss about school. the grooming by the um nuns you know even how to walk and you dare not pluck a flower no <laughs> yes and the compound almost always very neat mm. yes even the washroom i mean sometimes you could even eat at the washroom that is how well we were <laughs> so yes. so i i feel the the difference in in the generations how does it make you feel i know that Yes, you're doing something to support the system, mm -hmm. but you had a, a situation where you could just sit down and expect everything to be catered for. You were not uh, too cramped up in a dormitory. No. You were fed well. Okay. You, you had good uh, systems, even yes. um, very good libraries, up-to-date yes. libraries. How does it make you feel now? Because you walk into your school and it's, it's not what it used to be. In fact, that is the need why some of us just got up to do something about it. Now you walk into the school and it's like, where am I? It's like a different zone altogether. We were fed well. I remember St. Louis, it's a Catholic school. So they had a lot of saints' feast days. Oh, you yeah. know? So each feast day, you'd be surprised. We are served with chocolates and ice creams and you know, apart from the regular breakfast, lunch, and supper. Now, the dining is um, way, I, I don't know how to describe it. The dining can take 800 students. So can you imagine 2,400 students? Do they run shifts? They, they run shifts. And it's affecting the academic, you know, not that the academic status is coming down, but mm. We one, feel, you have to wait for a yeah, class to finish. A class to finish. Each year, one group goes. And it's, it's, such, it's making such a negative impact on the staff, too. You know, they have to wait. The, the stress, the, the, the classes, some classes have to delay because one group is eating, another is in class. And in fact, they are doing all that they can. And we feel we also need to come and give our part, you know, giving back what we receive. If we can't make it to the, no, the regular ones that we had, at least we can do something. Okay, so let's talk about the fundraiser dinner. Where, where is it happening and at what time? Oh, Rita, can you take it that is, um, It's happening at the banquet hall. That's um, big. Yes. It is okay. big. It's Lopsa. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> On Saturday, 28th May. Okay. Yes. We expect all Lopsa to be around p.m so that we can receive the visitors that we have invited. Mm, yes. yeah, you're expecting a lot of people. About um, you, God willing, really, yes. Yes, mm. we have a live band, the police band in attendance. There will be a um, fashion show sponsored by Blisco. Mm. We are all modeling, you know. You have oh, to, oh, 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 you have to come and see oh, us. Oh, yes, we are modeling. <laughs> <laughs> That's the interesting catch. Mm. They, yes. they wanted us to have the normal Ghanaian figure in it. Mm -hmm. So they didn't bring in models. So they are doing it for us. Yes, yes. And uh, we are expecting about not less than 500, 500. people. Yeah. Not less than 500. 500 yes. guests. So we hope Joy FM. Mm. Is it? Joy News. Joy News. Yes. Excuse me, but I'm so confused. <laughs> no, I got no, no, so well, we, 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 we are one, we are one family. Yes. Yeah. And I think Joy FM is also helping us mm. with some announcements. Yes. yes. So we will be inviting you to join us. Well, I'd, I'd love to see you modeling. Are you? I am. In fact, uh, Rita, I, you yes, are. Yes, Rita I am. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that would be, yes. be really beautiful yes. to see. In fact, in fact, they want us to come out with their clothes, and then they, they are giving them to us to auction, and then oh. add the proceeds. Exactly. 
and that's what they've mm. done. Meta, you wanted to say something? Yes, um, there's a special edition where um, a slop son will be, um, how do I put it, the, a documentary on how Saint Louis, attending Saint Louis, has really impacted. impacted yes, lives. and we will really wish that every slop son will come mm. and then look at it, including those who just wrote Wasi, who, who just finished this yes, year. Yes, yes, yeah, 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 yeah. everybody, okay. even the student. If we, we can't invite the students because the well, school, the school is, is in commercial yeah. yes. and it's in session mm. and traveling and all that. But those who wrote Wasi and it, no, yes, but, but everybody I think, is invited. But I think a, a section of the students should should come. Maybe the prefects or something. It, well, we have invited the headmistress and um, past headmistresses, the board, the PTA chairman. So we hope maybe the headmistress may come with a few. With a few of the students. Mm. Yeah. Because, because there's a way of passing you know, over the spirit. Exactly. Oh, that's exactly what we want mm. to happen. Mm. Because any time they finish school, we want them to come join the And it's the more catch them young, mm. and the more they <laughs> are in, you know, the better they are willing to support. Yes. Mm. Yeah. And Rita, so apart from the modeling and uh, uh, someone telling us okay. how uh, yes. St. Louis has impacted the life, what, what, what other things should excite me? Um, there is a slaughter who has written a book, and yeah. it will be auctioned. Yes, it will be auctioned. And what's the, the book on? Um, what's it? It's on poems. Oh, yes. poetry. Poetry. It's poetry. So yes. And then come and meet old friends. You know, it's so surprising to know that some people have not met after leaving school, <laughs> you see, and yeah. we've tried to rope all these people in. We've gone to every corner. So come and meet old friends and then. Mm. <laughs> so and uh, the dance. Your, 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 wait, before, before you come with the dance, I know something like Akata Slopsa. Oh, uh, wow. Are they coming? They, they are. are. <laughs> they are. <laughs> Amazingly. Okay. <laughs> Amazingly, we are. Okay, for, for our viewers who don't know what a kata slopsa is, can you help them? Oh, out? my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> a kata stands for akatechi. And mil, um, the slogan for Upukwari Secondary School. Okay, and they are your boys' school. <laughs> and in Kumasi, well, they are the Catholic component of the St. Louis mm. Catholic Girls' School. So we had a lot of programs together to the extent of, well, marrying some marrying of them. Marrying some so of them. It both happens. of us. Yes. Both of oh, us are married. Both are. Both oh, of us, yes. That's beautiful. <laughs> we both are. So oh. we are living testimonies of, of, the, of, the, of the strong bond between the <laughs> and Yes. yes. Oh, so we've invited beautiful. them. And in fact, they are buying their tickets. tickets yeah. And they are, we've invited a few to come and support. Mm -hmm. And... Um, we have the Akatechi as a, as a MC. Yes. yes, the Accra Akatechi president, president is an is a MC. Mm. And um, well, we do things together. So Akata Slops. Oh, yeah, you sure are married. But <laughs> it's, strong, it's stronger in the investors. When we come out, we are married quietly, but it's there. It's the there. there. Akata yeah. Slops. And what's the slogan for that? Don't know. You don't have a slogan. No, oh, no. you should learn from Santa Moga. The big family. Oh, okay. oh, you don't know the slogan for Santa Moga? No. Together. Oh wow! <laughs> I think we uh, maybe, take it out. I know. Well, you should find Akata something. Slopsa we don't have. You, you should. We have Slopsa High. I don't know the architecture is there. Mm. They deal with numbers. So. Okay. All right. <laughs> so, so someone is notifying us. It's the big family. Yeah. Akata Slopsa. Then you say the the big the family. Big family. Wow. It, it, it'll really be a. Uh, beautiful thing to see this okay. Saturday yeah, yeah. at the banquet hall at, at nine. Is it no, six no, o'clock? So sorry, I, I, forgive me. At six o'clock mm. uh, at the banquet hall this Saturday, something very beautiful is happening. Old students of St. Louis Catholic School in Kumasi are organizing a fund raising dinner to raise funds to build a six hundred capacity dormitory for students in St. Louis. It's a real pleasure to have had you, Rita and Winifred. Yes. Is it, uh, you look beautiful. Thank and you, you said you completed when? Oh my goodness. I <laughs> completed O level 75, A level 77. Wow. Yes, and I'm you? ancient. Uh, you are, you are <laughs> ancient. 83. Yes. Okay, so she's your, yeah. she's ahead of you. Did you, did you meet in school? No, oh, no, you couldn't no, have. No, yeah, no. you couldn't have. The gap was was too yeah, wide. No. Okay, so but your last words yes, convince someone. I'm appeal to be that there. we really want to make is, if we could get two thousand past students paying their levy of two thousand Ghana cities, mm. 
I mean, the pro project will be will be complete. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. So we are just appealing to all past students. We know we are capable of doing it, and for the sake that you got the chance to be in the school, let's all. Uh, but but, but you know, but you know, a lot of people don't feel excited when they leave school because of how the school treated them or how um, um, you know the the kind of harsh realities they had to face in school. Yeah, naturally, I think this is a natural phenomenon in every society. Um, people may not like being disciplined. One or two instances may go way bad, but naturally, you know, St. Louis, um, I think we were pampered. During my time, we were pampered. And um, a few ones who may not be excited, mm. I don't think, maybe we can count them on our fingers. Yeah. But, but you can um, still ask them to forgive. If you're not, we if you're not happy with St. Louis during your time, then just forgive and, oh, and support you. this course because it is really a great course. On that note, we'll end this interview, but it was a real pleasure to have Winifred and Rita here giving Thank us you. details of a fundraiser this Saturday at the Banquet Hall at 6 p.m. They're inviting all of you to come and support them. Build a 600-capacity dormitory for students of the St. Louis School. We'll take a quick break. When we come back, we'll do my banner.